Hey guys. Today we're gonna do a plant-based take on a Chinese favorite, General Tao's chicken. But instead of the chicken, we're gonna use cauliflower. Cauliflower is all the rage. You can find it on every Instagram page possible. You can saute it, you can deep fry it, you can rice it. Today I am going to bread it and pan fry it. I'm gonna use a little bit of panko and some all-purpose flour and a soy milk. So with my soy milk, to thicken it up a little bit, I'm gonna use a old vegan trick, which is adding a little bit of rice vinegar to it and it makes it into a thicker version of milk. You let it sit for a little while and it sort of buttermilks on you. Now that the milk is ready, we're gonna dredge the cauliflower. We're going to start with however many pieces you're gonna fry into the milk and then from the milk into the flour. It gets a little bit messy. Back into the milk and then out of the milk and into the panko. So I got a hot pan of oil going now. We're going to take the cauliflower and just drop it in and it'll start to cook. If you get to smoky with the oil, you're gonna burn a lot faster and we don't wanna burn. You need a little space in between your cauliflower so we can turn it over. It takes about three to five minutes. So you wanna hear that beautiful sizzle sound there. And you want the cauliflower to be a little more brown than you would think that it should be. It's sort of like cooking cookies. When you think they're done, they're not quite done. And then it's gotta penetrate to get inside of the cauliflower. You don't want a hard piece of cauliflower because we didn't blanch our cauliflower to start. We want a little crunch, but we don't want it hard inside. So we're gonna let the oil do its thing. Pull it out of the pan, let it drain on a towel. And while it's draining, we're gonna make the sauce for this dish. We're gonna start with the hoisin sauce and vinegar. This pepper paste is hot, so make sure that you add enough to your spice level. The sesame oil, which always adds lovely flavor to any dish, and soy sauce. I'm gonna add a little bit of water in this, and then I'm gonna add in my cornstarch. Now for the sauce, a little bit of ginger, because we didn't have any fresh herbs in that sauce when we made it. And a little bit of garlic, just a small amount. And then sauce. Cauliflower. Give the cauliflower a little toss to coat it. Let it cook for a little bit to let the sauce thicken and coat the cauliflower really well. And then I have a fancy rice. I have black rice. It is called forbidden rice. You could use brown rice, you could use jade rice, you could use white rice, you could use whatever, whatever kind of rice you really like. And I'm gonna add the cauliflower to the top. Oh, that looks delicious. So there you have it, a plant-based take on a Chinese classic, General Tao's cauliflower.